Um, hey there everyone, Zhao Cow playing Donkey Kong Country 2 and last time we beat the game, so that means we still have to beat the game. So here's the last way back at the island apparently, I think it's kind of a funny way of hiding it. Did my money got reset because the game kind of quit on me? Come here yellow bellies, uh, no I'm gonna give you money. So the funny thing is, so Animal Antics, you might have heard of this level if you've never played this game. The funny thing is, like, it is the hardest level in the game, probably. Yeah, I lost all my money because technically I beat the game and then it reloaded. Well, I can't get the tip yet until I find two dollars in the level. Like, the funny thing is, this is not necessarily the last level you're gonna unlock, because you can unlock these in any order. Of course, you have to beat them and you know, start right as Rambi, right as top. My lives got reset, too. Wow, that is... that is some rude behavior there. I'm gonna destroy all these... these rats. Could've charged a button, then you're gonna go like, check it out rats, I'm charging buttons. So that resets your life, huh? That's... like I had over 99. That is a lot of life loss very suddenly. Isn't there a secret here? No, you just walk. It's been a while. Now we're in the snow zone. My rhino is going to get cold. Whoops. Don't get bop. That guy's got a gun. It's the rhino's only weakness. Now I'm a fish. I'm gonna replace the icon in the bottom. I don't know if there's any hidden things. I'm just gonna go over here where there's this guy. Rare symbology! Yeah, that is a symbol, alright. And you get an O, too, for O no KO. There we go. Acapulco. Look at that. It's fish, though. It's, his name is Fish, and he's really great. He's really red. He's ready to perforate my face. Pretty rude to do. Don't do that, please. But that's that's Fugu Man, Fugu Zone. Welcome to the Explodia Theater, where everyone just explodes all the time. It's really, really weird. It's really unsettling. Check that out. Jobbers' nose. Nose one, even though you clearly bit me in the butt area. I don't care. I'm on guard. I do what I want, and then I charge my charge, and then I just kind of skill along. I can move clearly when there's a door in front. It's a part with a spider. Yeah, again, like, tons of bananas. But, midpoint too. But, no money. <laughs> huh. And I can't just go on the sledge. But well, check it out! That guy's got hops! Squitter's a spider. He goes splart all the time. That's his job. Okay. So, do you remember how to spell his name? It's gonna be on a quiz, probably. So yeah, you can probably go on that land there, or you can be smart and just kind of stay above everything. That's a smart way of playing the game. Well, I don't know if it's smart, but it's safe, so I'll call it smart, sure. That croc went conk! It's the sound he makes. Check that out, it's just one step at a time. There might be stuff going on underneath there. There clearly are bees going about, so... But you are generally supposed to go kind of up, because here we see the rising banana trail. Whoa, there! Yeah, that bee almost took me by surprise. So this is where you go to process, so I think the bonus is, yeah, is behind. There you go, last bonus game in the game. Destroy the bowl. All right, just tell me to. So you are in big old ramble zone. You gotta make your way home using your platform. Okay, but then your home turns out to be a barrel with the bird in it. But there's no bird in it, but you turn it to a bird. Basically the same thing. So I'm taking my time, as you can see. Because in the past, uh, there are bonus games that transform you. Wow, this is a long transformation sequence. Your timer is not exactly as advertised, I feel like. Anyway, now that I got this, I can go here and return in the bramble. Whoa, it's like noticeable load time. All right, playing bit four here. Except in that game, they couldn't. Okay, I was afraid there. 
I made decisions. Don't regret them. This place looks super weird because there's no bramble at all in the sky. It's just clear sky. There's just these random thorny vines everywhere. <laughs> and here we go. This is where the fun gets real. I'm a big fat pigeon and there's wind. Just, yo oh boy, and the wind, yeah, it does what it wants. Yeah, okay, so you don't go there. You do go in that little... Okay, just take your time, like, and just take your time. There's no timer here. You're allowed to be careful, mostly. Don't do anything rash. Just take it in and let the, the wind push you into an enemy. That's just an N. That's not worth it. Who in their right mind would think that was worth it? I don't know. What am I doing? What was I doing? What was my plan? I didn't have any, clearly. Well, I got everything, though, so I can press L and R, and he's happy. I didn't beat it, but he's happy. Oh, I'm tied! Oh, I haven't beaten him yet. Okay, that's right. You know what? Whatever, man. You got a face. Wait, so there's no DK coin barrel at the start of this area? I just realized... Uh... Huh. Oh, you need to go back for it a little bit. there just changed very abruptly. More than I expected. Okay. Uh, this is scary. But like it's it can't be that bad. I think that's how I died last time. Okay. Yeah, just let the wind guide you. I say just kinda of scrambling randomly. That's that's how I let the wind guide me. <laughs> Dang it. Uh, you know what? That's good. Uh, there's money up there, but like, it's way too dangerous. Whoa, jeez. Okay. <laughs> right at the end? I think that's like right at the end of this section. Hey. <sighs> yeah. I feel like there are safer ways to handle that part, but here we are. To y'all, y'all. Huh. There's a fine, easy way to handle that part. I'll just let you supply to hold. How can you glide, though? Like, your wingspan is tiny compared to, like, your mass. Unless you're, like, full of air. Like, that's a next step evolution after. After hollow bones, it's air full guts. Balloon. Just balloon. Just balloon. Camera is weird. Ah, 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 ah.
okay, okay, okay. Don't, okay, the wind stops here. That's really nice of you. Ah, Ratley time. The fifth animal, buddy. Please give me a DK barrel light right there. In the woods. In the middle of nowhere. I get a feeling that even though Ratley can land on a bee, no problem. The way this is made, uh, he can't land on those steaks, no problem. Steak dinner for Rambly. That's what all stories are about from now on. Uh, this big mean skull. Well, it's not really mean, it's just, just a big skull though. And the spikes. Yo, chunk it. Oh, great. One month. <laughs> I didn't like that! I didn't like that at all! I kind of need the money because I want to save. Oh, you know what? Is there anything here cool? No. What about top? No. What about top? No? Alright, well, you know what? I'll take going up. Got three lives, that means I can I have some attempts against the final 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 boss. Oh my god, an animation! So yeah, you can get there from any level spots in any lost worlds. I don't still have not any money for your hint, huh? Don't I? Yeah, I just got one dollar row. That's that's it. I guess I'm never reading the animal antics hints because I'm still kind of low-key mad that the game forces you to lose all your money and lives. <sighs> Let's give this a poke. I shouldn't. But, I mean, like, the level itself went by a lot better than I thought it would. Crim coins are shields. Wow, sweet! Fish gun, then, care rule. So he has... So, basically, yeah. By the way, yeah, you go here and you refight K. Rule, by the way. It's an extra fight where he goes all out. He's got his smoke gun, and it kind of mirrors the patterns of what we're doing here. Up and down and all around. That's all you need to know. Magic crystal to and fro. Three in a row. Check it out. Welcome to the world of crunchy rock berries. It is full of holes. That thing, it's super tricky, kinda. This is like the one where I feel like you really need Dixie. I don't think you need Dixie, but it helps. Helps a lot. Uh, wait, wait, okay, stairways. This part is easier with Dee Dee, but again, Dixie. She got the glide. Yeah, that right, that one's pretty tricky. So like, one last, oh, okay, I made it. Don't miss it. Because if you miss their chance here, you gotta go through the whole thing again. Wow, this boss fight here. This, I can't believe, like, this walled me. This boss fight, I thought, was super mega hard. But somehow, he gets launched into the magic portal while Dixie enjoys a juice box. <laughs> They're pretty nonchalant about all this here. Yeah, I did it! I'm a true video game hero! I f, f f finished it all! This, this last fight, I think that Animal Anik is still pretty hard. That wind part, it's kind of nonsense, but a lot more doable than I remember. But this boss fight here, though, I, that, this was a lot easier than I remembered. Hmm, have I improved my- I don't know if I improved my status, I can't tell. I can't read numbers, and I'm on a higher podium. Uh, Oh man, Cranky admit that he's wrong. Oh wait, Cranky just approved of Donkey Kong. Did you see that? Did you see that last sentence right there? He was like, yeah, like me and Donkey. Yeah, Donkey wasn't there to hear him though. And there goes Crocodile Island. But we can clearly see a Carol survive, like he's on the boat. The portal flashes weird. Carol's pretty happy about all of this. Maybe this was all an elaborate insurance scam. Cause like, that guy was laughing it up, you know? So, uh, well... This is it. The game never moves from the screen. You're locked out of your Donkey Kong Country 2 game cartridge. Oh, we can press a button, actually. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> Alright. Well, there we go! DKC2, 
definitely survived the tides of time. Although I wish, like, I feel like I don't give a clear image of how it was to play back in the day. Because I remembered so much and, like, I played platforming professionally for 12 years in a sense now. It's like, yeah, I, I wish I there was a way for me to showcase how it is to play it as a kid for the first time in all the struggle points, but... That's, that's just not happening in my personal context, sadly. But amazing game. I l super enjoyed replaying it. Um, I'm kind of... Uh, I don't know. I was about to say something. Look at that. 102%. That's not a real percent. What are you talking about? How do they call... Mine, well, let's see, Swanky, Enchanted Wood, Ship Deck, just press 5, there we go, it's just called Mine, got it. Uh, yeah, excellent game. Uh, I was able to deliver it in the context that I could deliver it. Uh, looking forward to playing Donkey Kong Country 3. That one I didn't play nearly as much as 1 and 2. Some, a lot of people would agree that 2 is better than 3. I still want to play I remember it being a very good game. It didn't, like, touch me the way the 2 did, but it's still an excellent game. Just maybe not a great follow-up to 2, but still a great game, so I gotta play it. But not yet. Uh, next in line was supposed to be Butts.SMC, but the author contacted me and was like, Hey, Rao Cow, that's actually a Kaizo game. You shouldn't play that. Maybe I'm working on a non-Kaizo version, but until then, you shouldn't play it. So I was like... Alright, that that makes sense to me, so what's up next then? Well, it's not a ROM hack, and it's not an official game, it's not a Smebex episode. So what are we left with? Oh, man, that part is so good!